in this session uh, let's discuss the various backup options we got okay at the top level uh, we can divide the backup into two levels the physical backup and the logical backup and again uh, the physical backup is divided into two options that all depends whether your database is running in a no archive log mode or a archive log mode if the database is running in a no archive log mode you can do only a cold backup this cold backup is also called a offline database that means we need to completely shut down the database and then take the backup in most of the organizations this is not possible when you are completely shutting down the database that means the users or the applications cannot access the database you need to let the customers know that you are taking a backup and the database is completely down that may be acceptable by your business or it may not be acceptable so in 99% of the organizations the cold backup is not recommended okay the major advantage of a cold backup is it leads to a consistent backup that means the system change number in the data blocks and the system change number in the control file will be the same if they are same it leads to a consistent backup remember that point if it is a consistent backup even recovering is very easy okay so this is one of the easiest backup but the only problem is you need to bring down the database okay the next option is your archive log mode that means you are running your database in a archive log mode where periodically the online redo log files will be copied as archive redo logs okay if the database is in a archive log mode you can both do a cold backup if necessary and do a hot backup hot backup is a backup where you are taking the backup while the database is still up and running yes all the users and the applications are still using the database while you are taking the backup that's cool right yes in organizations where zero downtime is necessary the dbas go for hot backup that is why it is also called online database that means the database is online while you are performing backup if you think about it right since you are performing a backup while the database is still up and running as you are copying the files the users or the applications are writing more data into the database so there are obviously extra steps followed in doing a hot backup what are those extra steps we will discuss in the next sessions okay apart from this physical backup option we got a logical backup option where if you want to take a backup of a specific table you can do that suppose i want to take a backup of a customer table or a sales table you can do that it's very easy oracle has provided utilities like data pump export import to do this kind of logical backups okay we will study couple of examples on how to take a logical backup okay as a dba you need to think what kind of a backup is really necessary for your organization and then based on that you need to go for it okay in the next session we will discuss each of these backups in detail okay